In Affinity Photo, you can quickly draw a straight line with a brush stroke. How to do that? In Affinity Photo, PC or Mac. In Affinity Photo, select the Paintbrush tool in the Tools panel. Then go to the Brushes panel, you can find that in the Window menu, and select a brush. I'm just using one of my pre-built brushes. Set the width, and then click the document. And it will just apply a paintbrush stroke there. But what you can then do is hold down the Shift key. And again, click and it will draw a line from that point all over to the new point. You can also repeat that, say go over here, hold down the shift again, and click, and it will draw another line. So you get a zigzag effect very quickly. You can repeat that, just click there, click there, click there. Each and every time, it will be drawn as a straight line. If you just click the document and just draw normally like this, and then you think, oh, I want it a straight line from now on. Hold down the shift, and as you do that, you'll notice it's a straight line. It will just draw it in a straight line, so up and down like that. Now it doesn't go the other way, you can't force it that way. Do that, have to release, and again, click the document, and it will draw a straight line if you hold down the shift. Now if you want to reposition it, just click again somewhere else, and then again, start drawing, hold down the shift, and apply. And you can see you do that, it draws a straight line across. Just gonna use a different brush, and again, apply, and again, hold down the shift. And straight away, you can see it's a straight line. Now, if you wanna go up, just click, hold down the shift, and it will draw a line upwards. Again, go somewhere else, hold down the shift, click, and straight away, you can see it's a straight line across that way. And again, there. Very quick way of creating a frame design. This also works with the other brushes. So if you go over here and select the smudge brush tool, select that, again, click on the document, it's got a design there, and then hold down the shift and go over the other side and click again, and you see straight away, it's a smudge straight across. Go again over here and hold down the shift, and you can see again, another smudge design that way, and so on. You can go backwards and forwards, again, creating a zigzag design or maybe a frame design. You can also use the paintbrush tool with the shift with symmetry. So just go up here, select the symmetry, paintbrush tool selected, and make certain you've got the lock on. Select the brush and click in the center. And then go any position out here and click again. Straight away, the line, straight line to that new position. Now, if you hold the shift down again, you can then continue to draw in a straight line and you'll see the design there. Again, click anywhere, and then straight away you see the line going there. Now, if you don't want to have that happening, just got to click and then hold down the shift. If you hold down the shift before that, it will apply it from the previous point. And click again, and so you can see that line. And again, repeat and repeat. The key thing is make certain that you actually hold down the shift and then apply. You can also modify the symmetry number, select a different brush, go to the center and click, and then hold down the shift, go to a different position and click again. And now your brush stroke is applied outward to that position. And you can continue again, creating all kinds of unique designs. You can select any brush. So again, click in the center or any start point you want. So click there and then drag out and then again, hold down the shift and then click again and straight away your design is applied from that to that position. And you can again repeat that again to create different designs. If you want to create more complex designs than this, you can always go to layer and new layer and then continue. So again, go to the center position or anywhere else, maybe there. And again, hold down shift and click and go another position there and back and forth to create all kinds of unique designs. In Affinity Photo 2.2, you can also use the feature with brush stroke. So I'm just gonna click and apply. So you've got this line very quickly. Once you've done that, you'll notice what you've got is a layer. This is of course, if you've got a completely fresh document, it creates a new layer as soon as you apply the brush stroke. If you apply it to an existing layer, then of course, you've got all the rest of the design. But what you can do, press return if you're using the move tool or enter, the enter on the keyboard, and then you can go over here, say vertical, 
and you can just change the value so you can reposition it. But you can also now with 2.2 go here, duplicate, and instead of one, you can make it say 10. And straight away you can see you get this design. And of course you can go the other way as well. Very rapidly create lots and lots of lines of this design. Of course, what you can also do if you're not using 2.2 is simply select and then hold down the alter option key and drag to duplicate that design and create multiple copies. But of course, if it's creating 100 copies, it's much quicker to do with the new feature. If you've got any questions, please let me know in the comments below. A like or dislike, always appreciated. Thank you much.